So first we go to the dashboard. Yeah. Inside these in products. So all product. This is video absolute hub. So I already log in and downloaded the sales page by clicking it. Just download the sales page. So after downloading, you will get the file a zip file like this. Just right click, extract all, and extract. So and check. Yes, this is the sales page. So this is our product. Intro and round, intro and outro expert. Here I just gave the name. Then give the price, make it virtual. Go to inventory, make tick this one. So individually only one product at a time. So this is the snippet view and everything. Okay, also we just need to have the product gallery and product image. So this is the main image. I uploaded those files. So the main image you can put uh, that what you want. You can put either from this uh, images folder we get from uh, that site or you can just uh, download anything from net and you can have so i will take this the logo image as the product image or any square will be it's depend upon you you can have any so for current now at least we have that this one or it will be great to have another one okay so okay we will see so Yes, this one. Select for product and uh, I update. And I right click, open link in new tab. So it will be like this intro and outro. So, and in product gallery, we will put some images also if you want let's say all this demonstration from here one and i click on shift and i select all these and add to gallery it's depend upon you you can have this all this now so update I refresh this product page so we have that gallery also so people can zoom and see okay and uh, we need to have some product description so either you uh, do it by self or uh, just uh, uh, type we will give external link. So first of all, I need to upload these pages there. So I go to FileZilla and connect to that, that uh, VPS. This, this one I have connected. So go in web. Inside the web, there is a digital edge online. Then here you have to go to public HTML. You inside that uh, FileZilla. So here, so what we do, 
uh, okay so first of all uh, we edit that link so this is our man you can get edit this code with uh, any editor i using this visual studio code and uh, you have this is the the page it's look like this you have to change this link get access now from here and also need to change this support link okay we will remove this for uh, the copyright and everything and we will put our work so we can do is so yes this one get access now one and two get access now we have to change those links so go to here and control f find get access now and you will find that tag a h r f is equal to hash and replace this one with our product link so first you have to create that product and you will get that link of that product and so when you create the product there is once you done you will have this link permanent link this is the same and i just put this ahr of this one. so get access now is here then here yes this also we have that links there and save the code and now go to the bottom and uh, copyright at internet Inter express here you can put that digital edge dot online all right so this all and uh, there is also the link support support uh, we will remove this cause uh, we are inside we are going to implement this inside so we don't need so no other extra changes needed all these things are same i just to find the support control app okay this is the support link they have given to hash that dream big fresh this uh, no here uh, you can have the link of your facebook uh, page chat messenger so you can have this i have made this one me dot me slash uh, like not this one okay uh, this facebook messenger or any link or toyco link we can have just like this uh, i go to some page so suppose this some page any page you have and then you will have have that link for that uh, messenger box uh, here this page for now this page more in settings yes or in page info yes settings and messaging uh, when you create that page you will get that link yes this copy link so currently for temporary i will putting this one but you can replace with your own link so here and i put this and before that you must put https double load that otherwise it will not work so this is the page okay so this is on local just refresh and see if everything is okay yes you can see if i click here i will go to that uh, website our page so it's fine now also from here i go to that page it's fine 
we change two links only get access now here and uh, get access now this uh, that uh, 30 day money guarantee is optional we can remove it also that uh, intro you just have to find that code here control f 30 days yes and you can delete this all the section 5 that this all section you can remove it if you want uh, but uh, it's depend upon you okay and here is the support link the support link is uh, opening the messenger so they can chat with uh, directly with us through our facebook chat for support if they need it and you can remove it also it's depend so our page is ready now we need to upload this all the page to our website so we are here so I will create some folder create directory all products uh, so we don't need to create this folder again and again I just create uh, one time and we will upload all the products there okay and just refresh the product is ready on that folder is ready. yes we have that all products so next time you have to upload all those files here so this intro and outro export we have that that zip file we have downloaded this file one minute yes have extracted here and we get this so instead of selecting these files you just have to go to one folder behind intro and extra folder you have to right click and zip it add to archive and just click keep ok so now you have to upload this zip file own file you just have to drag it no just drag put in this all products folder make sure you should not upload another place okay actually we don't have to upload this zip file because if you upload this file yes uh, you also need to go to terminal and export all those things so just go just uh, copy this path this path and go to filezilla because from terminal it might be more technical next time so instead of this we just yes this one and this thing so just click or right click on this folder and upload so you don't need to just keep that uh, previous step of uploading zip file you just have, have to upload this folder in, in this folder we have that index file js and that's all files just upload this entire folder to that uh, all products folder so you will have that all products slash intro outro export so you can delete we delete this file we don't need to upload this zip file <coughs> we just upload this uh, zip folder which have that uh, 50 or 60 files so it takes some five minute of time so it's very simple we just first create product and next time so i will just sum up this all these things yeah. so the work is till now what we did we first uh, created product to get link okay put that link with access now text okay uh, change 
support link upload the sales page folder entire folder after extracting to all products products folder online via filezilla now so yes all up uploading is done now we will go to that let's say digital ah online slash all products this is the common for we have created yes all products and then we have that intro outro this is for our purpose only this intro outro expert this is the folder name hope i am typing the same mm -hmm. yes some mistake is from my side the typing the folder name is intro a o u t r o we just have to check whether it is just uh, keep that uh, digital edge online products okay so url is this you see this url this this url is common that all products still all products and this is the folder name means yes. this is common this is the common url and you just have to the slash and the folder name of that particular sales page we have uploaded that now you can have that that the sales page is online and uh, from here user can get access now so we have given link to that product access and uh, we just need to have this link in our product description here below we will only give this link so in a product description here here is our product so just uh, have some uh, just like a yes, sir see details we just have see details of this product or any text click here to see the product to see details of this product we can have any text there and then select all and click on link this is the third button link and we put that url that our that we have uploaded this online and uh, where is it? yes here yeah. and we must uh, open this link in a new tab okay add a link so then in visual we have like this you can make it more bolder paragraph instead of paragraph make it heading so it will be more better and update you can also put some uh, what call images or anything but uh, we have the editor sales page we don't need to do anything yes it's this and now we will go here and refresh this so this is how the product is done so here in run outro click here to see the details of this product so the user will go to this new page and uh, this new page has the same url of our website means this entire that sales page we uploaded to our page that's why no problem they can see same exact the content and everything that have i just pause this one this that uh, whole sales page then they can read the description also they have that 
and so they have all the demos this pre-built demos so we don't need to create any video separately we just use this so so cell space is ready and when they click click on this uh, get access now or uh, this get access now anywhere just simply get uh, back to our product that our uh, that wordpress site and they can purchase it and if they want to see the details they can click here so this is how it will work if you put that uh, description here it will get stretched and not look well also we have the small description here the product and also give we give some link and that here also so here is the small short description of product and a short description they already give on that this one i just put this okay the same so we don't need we have that and uh, what the next we will give the this again link click here to see more details and demos and demos so i just click this one and have the link and i insert that link this uh, where is this is on not this one this is offline page and this is the online page we uploaded through that filezilla and here we enter the link and go to configure and uh, make it open link in new tab it's so uh, better so and update it so and just uh, also update the product so and the finally uh here if we refresh so we have the nice short description then the demo link here also and here is also so they can see the demo they can read the description see the demo and get access now is redirecting back to our website then here from purchase they can purchase like a other simple product so same way they just need to have that first name last name if they already have the account and login they don't need to even put those details and they can simply proceed with the bill please so and it is only the virtual product so they don't get any download uh, option what happen when they purchase it we have to manually give that uh, we have to create manually create that account uh, just that day i have shared the video from this video have episode uh, for that email we will send them that uh, login credentials that uh, account details and login a link so this is how it will work